Hi, Groves. How are you? So after my faux pas earlier today, I decided I'm going to pick myself up, dust myself off, and try again. This time knowingly live streaming. Then I've kind of been in a chatty mood since it's, that happened earlier today. I actually didn't make my kick in a mug yet. Hold on, I'm moving that over so I can read better. I didn't make it, excuse me, I didn't make it yet. I'm probably gonna make it in a bit. I did have um, some chicken and scalloped potatoes for dinner though. Right now I'm trying to um, figure out what kind of blog post I'm gonna do. Cause I really love this um, pew pew set from Deco Crate. Like I am in love with it. And then I thought, oh, why don't I use that Apple Fall um, build that I got from the Apple Fall sale because the skybox is free. So now I'm like kind of wondering what I'm gonna do with it. And I'm sorry if I keep pausing because I actually am like streaming music <laughs> in the background <laughs> because I usually decorate and I have some music on. So you guys might see me like pop over on my title and swap between albums. So sorry in advance. But I'm being honest in me. Right now, I really like this um, bonsai tree from Matt Mesh India, and I'm wondering if it's um, unlinkable. Like, if I unlink the tree, if it's unlinkable. Oh, it is. It's copyable, so let's try unlinking it. Let's see if I break it. That's a good question. Hi, Leva Games. Yeah, all this stuff is from Deco Crate except for the skybox right now. Everything that's like resed out. Oh, minus that Apple Fall chair right here in the corner. But everything else, yeah, this is all Deco Crate from today. Yeah, I was really excited for this theme. And I'm so, so, so really impressed with everything. So, okay. The tree is unlinkable. Let's move it up. Let's see if I killed the scripts. Uh, yeah, I did. Okay. So that was a dumb idea. <laughs> sometimes you can, sometimes you can't. Let's grab another one of those. That was Smash India. That was the bonsai tree. The core. Because this is how the pew pew table, how it is. This is how the full one is in the inventory. Let me guys. There it is. But right here, this one, this is that table. This one right here, the full scene. I like the full scene, but I feel like it's a lot of rocks, especially these big ones in the center, and I was thinking of doing a separate like centerpiece. And like the only thing I can think of right now is maybe the Zen Garden, but I feel like that's kind of Mm, I'm not sure about it. And then I thought, what about the tiny little bonsai tree from Hex the Ordinary? This one? But I don't know if that would work either. And then this could work, but what if... I mean, I could make it smaller. Actually, that wouldn't look bad with that small. And then there's another one with Mesh India. There's that one. There's Warren Fountain. Yeah, there's the stone and sand one too. So what if we did both of those, if I could select the right thing and um, shrink it as well. And then those could be like the centerpieces for the table. So I don't know. I'm thinking that might work, maybe. I don't know. You guys have to like hear me just ramble out loud of what I'm maybe thinking of what I'm gonna do. Okay, hold on guys, I hate this song. I'm listening to Gorillaz, Plastic Beach, one of my favorite albums. Um, I had rather listen to Broken while I'm working, sorry. Like I said, I'm gonna be flop flipping back and forth a little bit. Um, I'm gonna move this up and to the side, just in case my idea doesn't work out, so I just have it rezzed out already. Hide that. Let's move that up and move it to the center. And also, 
I have other food that wasn't a part of this um, deco crate from um, Ada Fate a long while ago. And I'm kind of wondering if maybe I replace maybe two of the paths, the placemats, if they're unlinkable. If I can get rid of that stone in the center, then I would definitely do something with that. Like, see, if we put these, like, kind of in the center right here. I I like that. I think it's really um pretty. I kind of like it. Like, putting those at the edges, at the ends, and then, like, figuring something else for the um center piece. This one's bigger than the other one. It's still, I think, not... Let's minimize that a little bit more. And then let's actually center it. So. Did you really get ejected from a parcel on the mainland? Aww. I don't think I ever go on mainland except for like my Linden home. Like I know Alicia goes and explores sometimes. And whatnot, but like me, myself, I'm like never really at a mainland. Let's make the color of this. I think I like the the magenta leaves. It was cute. Gives a little hint of peak of color. Okay. I know this is copyable, so we're gonna make a copy. And I'm gonna see if it's unlinkable. No, it's not. It's all one land impact. Ugh. Oh. That's why, probably because it has a script inside to change the um, stuff. Oh, I wish that stone in the middle, because I would um, I would totally put out some of the Ada Fate stuff. I know exactly what I'm thinking of right now, and it's gotcha items. Let me make a prem so I don't lose anything, because that would suck. I've already had enough faux pas for today. Uh, right there, inventory, objects, if I stop lagging. You're traveling around looking at places mainland because of, oh, it's cool. Okay, objects, gotcha, that should be, up top, not the bakery. Where is it? It's a good question. Did I throw it in food? Yes, I did. Ate of a sushi. Two seconds. Okay, sorry about that guys. Had to mute for half a second. Um Okay. This is this is the set I was talking about with the sushi. If I could um get rid of the stones in the center, I'd throw out Oh, what if we put some of these out in this for the centerpiece, like in between those two stones? That could work, maybe. I'm thinking. Okay, what numbers did I actually open? Like, I got this forever ago. That's a good question. When did I get this? 2015. 2014. I keep going back and playing every once and again. Um, so I have number five, which is soup. Number six. Yeah! So earlier today, I just, I legit just thought I was recording my deco crate, like, a video full of, like, mistakes and everything. I, uh, like, yelled at my daughter in the background to, like, be quiet. And, like, that whole time, I didn't know I was live streaming. And I'm, like, randomly chatting to myself, talking to Alex on Discord, and whatnot while recording. It, it was horrible. <laughs> that video had nine dislikes. I completely, once I knew, I, I completely deleted that video. 
because there there is no living that down. Apparently, two seconds. Sorry about that. Okay, let's res out number nine. I think nine. Number five, probably. And I think 16. So that's nine. Let's do number five. And then let's do 16 and see how that kind of looks. Just to add a little bit more color to the center of the table. I thought it might look nice, maybe. stuff happens like that to everyone but like I never expected it to happen to me I just felt horrible so we put that one right there and get this one kind of centered kind of right there. I don't feel like that last one um works now. What other numbers do I have? Because look, it's kind of pink colors in the center. So I'm wondering what else might work. Oh, number eight was a rare. Do I have that? No. <laughs> of course not. I have number three rare, though. Uh, I have a 12. Not a 11. Okay, five. Number six. Yeah, how about we do 13, since it's kind of a um, thing. Okay, let's take that one back. Let's do 13. Take off build tools, that would be smart so I can unpack the item when I stop lagging. Move that to the right folder. Oh, waiting for that, delete that extra placemat. Now let's move this up and over. Bounce what on the other side grows. I hate, this is the one thing I don't like about um, YouTube live streaming because everything like has this time delay of when I see the comments actually pop up on my side. <laughs> like that I don't like. I don't know if that really balances. And I feel like these are too big now. Like, see if we make it that size. I feel like it looks better. And then move it closer to the edge. Because then it's not super overwhelming the table. Maybe. See, so yeah, that looks a little bit better. I need to make this even though. I think that's about the size. Kind of move it a bit. 
bit more centered. I think that might work. I'm not sure. Yeah, the delay. <laughs> Don't. I will say this: if anyone like really wants me to talk about something like up front, like just go ahead and um hit me up on Plurk, and you guys will just hear Plurk going off in the background. If I turn back on my sound, that'd be great. On my phone. I'm sorry. <laughs> Everything was so quiet suddenly. I think I need new music. This music's just kind of like, mm, it's annoying me now. Okay, guys. What am I going to listen to now? Let's go. What do I have? I have a ton of random music. I'm not even done with title yet, trying to get stuff. Ooh, everything with a girl. Mm. You know what? New Gorilla album. I know what two songs I want to listen to real quick. Andromeda and Bustin' in Blue. I love those songs. Those are great. If you guys haven't listened to the new album yet, you should. Anyways. <sighs> but I think this will work for right now. I'm going to delete this for the center thing. My favorite AO sword. That's the funny thing. I don't buy AOs very often. I have three total. This one I have currently is Tutus, if I'm even pronouncing that right. Hold on, animation. Wait, that's not the right thing. It's in body parts and it's always have on. It's in my, yeah, Glam Girl. I got this in, I want to say 2014, I think. Let's look at the properties. Yeah, I got this in October 14. And then the one I had before that was the Sensuous, was, which was the first one that I got when I joined SL, basically. April 2013. I joined in February, but I really didn't start using stuff until like April. <laughs> but that's actually a question I had to all of you. What good AO stores? Because I don't, I'm a little bit clueless. And the only other one I have is on body language which I got only because of the um, the poses, the bonus poses that came in it, and that was it. And then I also have my ankle lock because I got sick of broken ankles a very long time ago. But yeah, that's all I got. Hi, Red Sonia. How are you? Do you see? I'm. That's the one thing that I openly admit I'm really bad at. I'm bad at putting dances together in HUDs, and I'm bad at putting animations together in HUDs. I'd rather have something like already done. And I wish sometimes that like um, creators for animations and poses would have it so that you can um make a hud for someone else and like send it to them things aren't even there we go that was bothering me anyways um what else is there from deco crate i know something i love but it wouldn't work like indoors is this lamp like i love this thing I don't know where I'd even be able to put it with it actually like making sense to the whole scene because I don't have advanced graphics on right now because I'm on my laptop because I usually do everything on my laptop normally and then photos I take on my um, desktop and like really good videos I want I do it on my desktop <laughs> Dazzy Pops AO place? Oh, I'll have to check them out. 
that's something I that's one I have not heard of before at all so that'll be interesting so yeah how are you doing tonight I wonder if that would work over here no it will not oh I wonder if I could shrink this down it's land impact of three if I shrink this No, I don't, I was thinking of maybe window sales, but then that doesn't make sense since the background's already set with the apple fall. Like if it was nighttime and then I made, and all the shadows are already baked in, so I can't do that idea. I just gonna like start lining them up. Cause my field of vision, I kind of want to do it like around like right there. That's like what my viewpoint wants, I want it to be. So I'm trying to make this area kind of cohesive. So I could maybe put it right here in the center right there. I don't know. I'm going to res out a fresh one and see how that looks. Kind of do it like that and then center it and then kind of see how that looks and while I think of it I don't know if you guys like went to um, post fair earlier share back in April but if you guys didn't grab the black tulip camera tool it is at the main store I advise getting it because you can save all sorts of camera positions and if you're like me and you swap like computers back and forth you can use this to save your um camera view and kind of work around it i need to uh i would like to save this this would be number six this would be deco deco create august now and send one Like, so you can move around and then if you hit your escape key and it hit restore to your part, which would be number six, you would have, yeah, and it moves it back exactly to like where it needs to be, which is really kind of nice. I think I'd actually do it more like right there, but as long as like I have a good like starting point, I'd be okay. Um, what if we... Put that right there, kind of along. I think I would make this bigger, actually. Oh, the camera tool, um, black tulip. It's at the black tulip store. Um, let me copy the SURL for you guys and throw it into. Seriously, I can't paste. Oh, because it didn't truly, meh, hold on. I'm trying to do too many things at once. There we go. Okay, I'm the chat person. Like, I don't know why you're not gonna let me put it in there. It's not letting me type in. Oh, there we go. There we go. There's the link to where you can get that. That, that was trial and error. That's too big. I kind of like that. 
Hi guys, welcome back. Sometimes I drop. <laughs> Every once in a while, OBS will like disconnect with live streaming, and I should have figured it out earlier when it kept doing that, and it kept like kind of met crashing me. I don't know why I didn't figure it out. I almost feel like this would be a better picture if I had people in here with me, like sitting and like our conversation and having dinner. I might have to do that. See, that would be redundant to like have this fountain over right here when you already have this one kind of right there. So I can't do that because that's like extreme redundancy, even though I think this one's really well made as well. Good question. Hi, Papa. How are you? I'm trying to um kind of figure out everything right now because I'm really. I know there's some stuff from the modern minimalist decocret also that would work and I keep needing to remind myself that you don't have to use only things that came in your crate for like your blog post you can use other items as well so I'm gonna try to do that this time conservatory that was the um was it May modern minimalism yep So that is a good question. I have all these fountains. If it'll actually res out, that'd be great. Whoa, Jesus, that's huge. Uh, no, delete. <laughs> Yeah, this table is like my favorite thing. I've kind of messed with it a bit and added pieces onto it to kind of give some color and pop a little bit. But I am in love this, with this table. I'm gonna have to watch your latest video, Papa. I need to watch Cash These too. Has anyone else today had issues with YouTube? Like, you know that someone uploaded something but it's not showing in your um, subscription list. I had that, w I've had that with like most of Cassie's videos today. Like I have yesterday's dating show in my subscription list, but anything that she's uploaded today, she, like it hasn't popped up. I had had to go like directly to her channel to watch it. And I'm just kind of like, what on earth? So I'm wondering if I've missed anyone else's stuff today too. Um, face branches. Um, Aria. Decor. Uh, mud honey. Sorry, sorry. Pegboard wouldn't work with this scene. Because you guys know also with the skybox, whoops, that you can um, change the textures, it changes. If you touch the center part of that wall, because normally I have it up as, um, yeah, it's Alicia's videos. Yeah, I just get them with like random videos today and I don't know like what is going on with that. But like the background, I normally have it like set up as a basic, which is like how you guys have been seeing me do like kind of, kind of my random vlogs lately. I love the floor texture, but I didn't think like the walls, it was just a little bit plain and the table sets already black and white. So I didn't want to just do black and white. Then I had the brick, which I was trying to work around, which I think is a little bit better. But then there's black panels and then that's just like, 
look at that that's so much black and white and it's like that's not enough color and then if i do blank it's like we're trapped in an asylum insane asylum and apparently we can have food here and then it, it's just it's so plain so i think i'm gonna stick with brick when i have to <laughs> So, I don't know. Why did my stream stop? Oh no, it's still going. I don't know. It said that my stream wasn't going for half a second. I don't know why. <laughs> but, um, I don't know what else to do. That chair has got to go, though. That just looks weird in the background. You know, I want to replace these lanterns with the ones from Tarte from Summerfest, and I just realized I did not buy those. So that is a wonderful question right now. Um, yeah, exactly. Like, that's why I loved it. And I was so excited when this, like, was listed for um, Zero Linden during that sale. And I was like, really? This is Zero Linden? Like, really? Wait, it's just, yeah, that's right. It's like a whole bunch of different, it's like brick and then it's white. I'm making sure that I didn't like mess this up. Okay, yeah, that's how it is. Ignore. Um, it's kind of trying to figure out what will work and what won't work. Kind of. I know I've gotten a lot of decor paintings lately from Loft and Aria. It's just a question of where did I put them. Because I just organized the other day. I think I put them in pictures. Or a few of them might be outside of that. Let's see. Yeah, this is the from Apple Fall. Hold on. Chateau T. This is the New York studio apartment. This was for Zero Linden for during that sale. It's only a land impact of 10. So like I usually kind of have it as my vlog headquarters that I haven't decorated because I don't know what to do with it. So I just kind of deleted all, all the chairs that were kind of about and um, started resing this stuff out. Cause I thought it'd be nice to like have dinner. Cause I was gonna do it with the um, conveyor house that they did, the bath house. But that would be more work because I'd be doing it up on a platform, which means using more of my land impact available for like decor, like scenery, like trees and whatnot to make it kind of look real, like it's downstairs. So, but I didn't feel like doing that, so sorry. Um, Aria, Rur, I don't even know. I'm like now thinking of a picture like for right there. Uh, that could work. Yeah, it was. I told you guys my last actual real live stream. I told everybody that they needed to go to that sale because it was completely and totally worth it. Uh, I don't think this goes right there. I'm like thinking this will go and work, but it it's not. No. <laughs> okay, let's let's get out of edit mode so we can get back into um. There we go. And if we move it over, so it'd be like around right there. Oh, I'm glad that people got that sale. Like, I think I ended up with like 97 items from that damn sale. And then I did the floor plan sale. I didn't get that much, I that many items, but I did that one too. I forgot where I threw that stuff. 
because I have like separate little folders. Not the subscription box. I think I did a um, summer sale folder somewhere. Yeah, I did summer sales. So it's apple fall and then there's floor plan. Did I get anything from, oh, no, balloons don't work with this. I was like all excited for half a second, guys. You have no idea. Uh, the heck does that console table look like again? I'm not sure. And it's not unpacked, of course not. Ah, there it is. Let's delete that box. Did really no one really see the skybox but me? <laughs> I like went on and on about it during that live stream. I think that one's still made public, so you guys can go back and watch it and watch me be rambling like I am right now. But that was during the afternoon. You know, I know it's supposed to be deco crate, but I prefer this. I prefer this console table to like the one that came with this set right here. Like putting items on top of that. Uh, well, let's see what it looks like. Probably won't even work well. <laughs> well, actually, it might. I can't. I do. I like this table better than the one that came with this. Okay, so the cloth is linked to the table, but the lanterns and the urns aren't. What do you guys think? Do you think the black table looks better? As I freeze. Oh, wow. Oh, once Firestorm stops freezing on me, what do you guys think? <laughs> Which do you guys think is better? Okay, there we go. Okay, what do you think is better? The table that came with the set for Deco Crate or this table from Bronkite? Bronkamp. I'm probably saying it wrong. I think I say every brand wrong. From Vagabond. I really like, I think I like the black better. Which one do you guys think? <laughs> any, any suggestions on this one? I'm like trying to figure it out myself. Let me go back to that um camera view and kind of move it. Maybe like from there, I it's like yeah wood, but it's not the, even the same kind of wood as is on this table. That's what's I think that's what's tripping me up a little bit. I don't like that. I do know what plants I want to start adding though. What's next? For sure. Let's throw that into the floor plan sale folder. I like the black one more too. I think it it looks better. Whoops. Um, cause there'd still be one, two, three, four, four, five items left if I take away the table from Vagabond. Okay, I need hover tips on for a little bit here now. Yeah, it does match more to other items. That's what I'm thinking too. And I, I kind of like it better. And it looks better with the brick, like having black items for the most part. Okay, I'm just going to outright delete that. Uh, and now it's kind of about getting this correct. Okay. That means you need to be moved up. This painting needs to be moved up a little bit, like to right there. And 
and that and then like maybe adding a few other little things on the table bye my groves i hope you have a great day and happy cleaning to you thanks for stopping by have a good day um for right now i think i like how that's going now regarding plants home miscellaneous not pictures but plants and then my whole what's next folder house plants i say let's put a rubber tree in the corner right here just to give it a little pop of color Actually, I think I'm going to make it bigger. Actually, no, I don't want the one in the stand. If I'm going to stretch it, then I should just do the plain rubber tree. That looks good, maybe, once we get out the ground. Yeah, that looks better. Kind of in a corner and then change the color. Let's make it a pattern. What does blue three look like? I can't remember the patterns offhand for all this stuff. Oh, in front of the brick? Yeah, I like that. It, like, gives a little bit more dimension. And see if I use a black, not black, but a blue pattern from the planter, it kind of ties those items into the rest of the room a little bit. I kind of like that. I like number two. What does number one look like? Nah. It's either two or three. What's three again? Three was like really minimalistic. Yeah, I like two the best. I like that. I think it looks pretty good right there. Not sure. Okay, let's hit escape. Let's kind of tweak around. See, that looks good right there. This extra lantern right here, something else can go in its place. See, we're, we're getting somewhere. Okay, I'm not going to use hex to ordinary. At least not this time. So I'm just going to go ahead and get rid of those. Hi, Lydia. How are you? Why didn't you message me earlier <laughs> when I was live streaming? <laughs> oh. When I was live streaming by mistake. Lydia was a witness to my horribleness earlier. Um, what does that one look like? And then the calypsis. I don't like this one. Okay, if we do it like that. Perfect, okay. I know what I want to do. We can have this one and then we can throw it onto the um, windowsill over here. go. Let's try not to lose the shadow since it's kind of built in. Uh, that menu pops up. That'd be great. Okay, so there's blue. Uh, what's blue look like? Eh, not feeling it. Maybe a patterned 
but not the same one. Spread the shallow. Other, that's all it is. Okay. Uh, what's natural three look like? I don't like that. Natural two. I feel a change. Two. And now it finally changes. SL is being really slow for me tonight. I don't know why. Probably because I'm streaming. That's green. Oh, I like that. I think I'll keep it green. No, I won't. Never mind. <laughs> I lied. Okay, how about we do blue blue number three with that? Minimalistic, a little base speck of color. That would work. Let's go back to exit. Kind of do a few right there. I think an extra pot, like right there, would look nice. If we do that again, oh yeah, look at that. That's a bit better. You know, if that's the case, then let's just move all of these items over. Let's do it. Let's get the viewpoint right and then we drag it over and kind of make it centered from there. Now you can move that over a little bit and everything's kind of symmetrical. Yeah, like sometimes being minimalistic does work. I think it's a nice looking scene. I'll probably see someone do something else and be like, uh. I know one person <laughs> whose stuff I always love is Wind's Tempest. Like when she puts together a scene, it's like freaking magic, guys. And I love it. This is the only thing that like does not go. That right there. And I'm wondering if I do a view kind of like that and cut it off. And then we would have to move this over a little bit. I didn't know that the, um, <laughs> hi Lydia, I didn't even know really that I was on um, streaming until like the very end when I kind of like figured it out when I like opened my phone because my volume had been off and I had an email like you're streaming. I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> and then I like saw all the comments and all the dislikes and yeah, I ended that stream so quick. <laughs> I'm still mortified by that. It was pretty bad. <laughs> It was pretty bad. <laughs> but that's okay. It happens. And there's just kind of nothing that you can do about it. You get over it and you move on. I think. I kind of like this viewpoint too. Hold on, let me save this. Uh, save. What's your fear forever, Papa? Seven, back for eight. Meh. Yeah, like I I did it and I guess now I won't um do it again. Okay, let's move somewhere random and then hit the escape key and oh yeah, I like this viewpoint right here. No, I wasn't right here. I was like Closer in, what the heck? Yeah, I was like right there, what on earth? Huh, did it not save? Oh, restore, am I on number six still? 
seven. He should have, um, dang it. So what's number six is, oh, okay. That is different. This doesn't match. This is the one, th whoa, this game. This is the one thing in this scene that just does not go. And I don't know what to do about it. Like, I like it, but I don't think it really goes. I wish there was another type of um, lamp. A really tall, big lamp. That's what I would like to put right there. There was one, like a lamp, but it really is more um, outdoorish. That came with pocket gotcha in it. What? Not pocket gotcha, I'm sorry, for, with um, deco crate. I saw the pocket gotcha folder and my mind wandered for a minute. Um, it was. Yep. It's Marek. Is that garden light, and I don't think that would work in here. Yeah, it does not. If we meh, moved it over here, and no, it doesn't work. It does not work. I don't know, guys. What do you guys think? You think this is okay? The Mesh India? Stone Lantern. You know I might flip this around and put this right here so you can see the detail of the the tree. Oh, this cam angle is like the worst. You try to move something and then um, everything goes to hell. Okay. <laughs> so if we move this, wait, this is copy a little too, right? Let's see it if we, meh. Let's make a copy. Let's throw right here. Whoops. To escape, yeah, you would actually be able to see the detail a little bit better if we put it right there. Okay, I think that's what I'll do, and then that one I'll get rid of, and then we'll move. And actually, while while this is right here, we can see if it's the same size. This one needs to be a tiny bit smaller, like right there, maybe, hopefully. Yeah, that's about good. And now let's move that to right there. And apparently it needs to be lowered to right there. Okay, if we hit escape. God, you really can't see. I'm going to have to make this bigger. Are you like are you in the picture? Even if I swap to the better computer with advanced lighting, you're gonna miss the details of this tree, and that's really going to bother me, cause it's really well made. Cause see, like that, that's too big. I don't know what to do. Hmm. Oh my god, and I also just realized what else I could have done instead of the um, eight of eight sushi, the Mad P tea set. Uh, it's either dark two or light one. Which one matches the table more? I vote light one. Okay, so instead of this white plate right there. Hmm. Okay, so if we get rid of that and we take 
that away. So we bring this up, rotate it, move it, kind of resize it a bit. I think that would actually be okay to be right there instead. But like I said, it really needs to um, be resized. Just a wee bit. Oh, see, like that. That doesn't look bad. It feels a little bit more cohesive to me. And then we move that down a little bit too. Maybe that looks better? Maybe? Yeah, I think I like that a little bit better. Okay. If there's another item that I missed within that um, AF8 set that has the same color wood as this, I will totally res that out. Get rid of this in the center, move the T set to the center, and then put the other thing on the end right there, and then do another stone bowl instead of the one with the um, bonsai tree. That is what I'll do. See, like, decorating is so much trial and error of me because I am not that great at it. And I always wonder how people are able to just create stuff like <clears throat> at a drop of a hat because I can't do that <laughs> at all. Let's see. What number was that? I think that was a 13. Okay, a number four. Number two has the same kind of wood. Okay, I have, I have a four that I haven't unpacked. And I have a 14. 4 and 14. Hmm. I can't do number 3 because that's more soup and that's just kind of redundant at that part. <laughs> With this how it's set up right now. So I can't do that. It takes me days to decorate too, Lydia. Like the Ansu house that I need to blog <laughs> or do a vlog video tour, I keep adding stuff to it. So I've kind of cut myself off and I've given myself until the 10th to at least record the video now. So hopefully I can get that out before um, Tuesday, next Tuesday. Which one of you guys think looks better? Four or fourteen? I think fourteen because it kind of looks like more condiments. Let's unpack fourteen. This is what happens when you get gotcha items like forever ago and then you forget to unpack them. But you know they're there and you remember kind of what they look like but you didn't unpack them. That's my life. Hi Jordan, how are you? You're at a post store? Aw. I need to do a post store too. You know, I actually had this huge idea for um collaborate, but I can't upload money until tomorrow. But I have this huge idea in my head and I'm wondering if it would be better with just me in the scene or me and someone else. Like, I'm really wondering. And now I'm all scared to say idea because someone might take it. Um, okay, let's take that back. Let's move the tea set to the center. Oh, I like this better. <laughs> Already. Let's rotate this to the side. Let's move it up. Let's move it over. move down let's move it back over and put it kind of right okay that set that on that which means the tea set needs to go about right there you need to go down so we still see shadows and then you just need to be copied over to right there there 
Guys, how does that look from that viewpoint go angle? I think that looks a lot better and a lot more cohesive. And with this one, since it's like, that will be the viewpoint angle, we just need to move that down like a, t a tad. And it hit escape C and then like everything's kind of evenly spaced out. I like that better. <gasps> oh, if I'm like sitting here, Are you good on photos for the next three weeks, Jordan? Yeah, me and Postsource, it's like a love-hate relationship. Like, I always find stuff that I want to do. And then I have to tweak it with, like, Animir. And then I get upset that I have to, like, even um, tweak it. So I'm kind of mm, about it. That's probably what I should have rest out, that stuff. I think I like this. I have... A secondary idea if I put myself in one of the poses that this chair has and then I put on one of the pixie cat outfits from epiphany which I can't remember exactly what it looks like right now so you guys are gonna come with me while I um, open Flickr and I just realized my music stopped I'm trying to remember I know I don't have one of the rares so I also have to wait for this to res all the way. This is annoying. I just said res. I meant load. Yes. What does your epiphany set look like? Because I can't remember off the top of my head right now. I know it's Asian inspired. Very much so. There it is. It's this one. I don't have either. I wish I had one of the rares. That would have been perfect. Oh, wait, but I have this dress in black. Do I have them black and yellow or? Uh, pixie cat, black, yellow, and then I have the mini one in black and pink. And that's it. I don't know. Uh. Because I know I can make the trim silver. Yellow would be a pop of color, though. That would be for sure. I think I want green. Does anyone have a green pixie cat dress and matria, green or blue, that they don't want? I, like, love you forever right now. Or maybe I am gonna might have to find one off of, like, Marketplace for, like, super cheap. I don't know. Oh. oh, did you decorate your Linden home last night, Lydia? How did it turn out? Pictures or it didn't happen. Oh, and has anyone else tried the Leluca heads today? <laughs> and tried to create shapes for them yet? I tried earlier and I was like, mm, nope, not today. Cause it, it, it like, since I got up this morning, it's just been one of those off days and it's like, mm, nope, nothing that I'm going to do is going to go right. And it turned out I was correct with thinking that so far. Do I have other lanterns? Plant. I can't spell. That's why. Hi, Freya. How are you? Did you make a shape that you liked for the head? And which head was it from Luca that you made a shape for him? Oh, no. You quit after? See, I tried on the, um, the heads, and I was just kind of like, hmm. Cause I was all excited like from like the pictures and Chloe. Yeah. I got my update for um Simone and like I'm in love 
with this HUD. Like, I, I love what they did with it. Completely. Uh, okay, I don't have other lanterns that I thought would work for this. Never mind. But anyways, let, since I'm wearing the HUD right now, I might as well just open up the HUD. So, LaLuca redid, revamped, like, the, um, whole animations, and now there's different moods, because before it was just, like, happy and neutral, so of course I had myself in neutral all the time, but now they have, like, all these little snarky little moods, and, like, I'm in love with them. Hold on, I will stand up, and I will pose myself, and I will cam to myself, and you guys can see these moods. Like, my favorite is Irked because that is how I have felt today. I am irked at myself for live streaming without knowing. I'm irked at the people who I end me because of that, like going off on me. I'm just irked at today. So this is irked. This is like my favorite <laughs> expression. And I like um, combining it together with idle and natural because they cycle through like randomly with them. And I, I love it. I absolutely love it. Spencer, which one was the one that I ended up, because I know I've relogged today already. Um, I, it's not objects, it'd be my demo folder, Luca demo. I think the one that I was about to start messing with was um, May, actually. I'm not sure, let me double check. Cause I have that open like all day. I can tell you as soon as I see the picture of it again. Yeah, I was about to start messing with like um, May because in the beginning I thought it'd be um, Greer and Bianca. When I put on Bianca, and Greer and like with how long their lips kind of are even without um messing with stuff I was just like no and I don't like Spencer I don't like the lips like my thing I like the lips of May of how it actually looks like it really kind of comes in a little bit like how Greer does because Bianca doesn't look like she really has a clip um lip clef too much and neither does um Spencer for me like I can't explain it but yeah I like irked I'll go back through the rest of them yeah the lips on cinema and then every single one of their noses for me they kind of all look the same I could tell it's a little tweaked like a little bit different but it's all kind of but it button nosy except for Bianca Luluka should make a male head one day. I mean, I'm happy that Alex finally has a mesh head because he got one like earlier this year, finally. And it's Katoa. It's Katoa Daniel, I do believe, that he finally got. So, and we tweaked forever to make a shape for him. So yeah, I'm not in a rush to um, him to get another head. Okay, this is the alluring facial mood. I love that little eyebrow raise. It's kind of like, mm. But I don't, I like it, but I don't. Like, I'm not too much of a smiley person. <laughs> so. You want to like me, but you don't think you found a shape. Yeah, I like. I think tomorrow I'll probably play around with like shapes because I'm that person. Like, when a head comes out, I mess with shapes. I don't buy. Whoops, didn't mean to actually open all of that. I meant to snooze. <laughs> I like. I make like. I get a demo of a head, and then I start like tweaking around with a shape. And once I actually make a shape I like, then I'll start considering to buy that head. I didn't do that with Simone because of the rebate deal. And I was like, screw it. I'm going to get half my money back anyway. 
let's spend the 2500 or the 5000 and I'll get 2500 back. And then I messed with it and I got a shape I liked. Okay, this is the aloof one, which I also like a lot too. I think it's kind of, it's different. Kind of, it's a little bit whimsical to me, honestly. It's like, oh, I'm aloof. I'm thinking of everything else in the world and kind of in my own little world, doing my own little thing, kind of mood. Oh, I just like it. Okay, Night Papa. Yeah, Daniel, they're like, I will say this. The, the heads that Genesis Lab has made for the guys for the gotcha, like the ads look amazingly good for them. I'll say that much. And Daniel's not bad at all, or Stanley for um Katawa at all. The AK heads, I haven't seen that many like on people. I've seen them in Strawberry Sings videos, but like I just haven't seen too many on guys. I think most guys are wearing them. Um, Daniel from what I can see. This is the blase mood. <laughs> I'm sorry, I never played this one all the way through. That yawn is everything. <laughs> that yawn is everything right now. <laughs> I am loving these moods. Okay, this is happy. My email keeps going off in the background. You didn't like the AK heads, Jordan? Aw. It's too smiley. I'm just, I'm not smiley at all. Then idle is kind of idle mood and then like your eyes will actually move around on their own which I like oh Genesis Lab I like I said I like how the Genesis Lab heads like look for guys in the ads but I don't know. I feel like guys have it so much harder sometimes in SL with like finding things like clothing and heads and I feel bad for you guys. But you guys are getting a lot of great hair lately from Stealthic. I think that's how you say his name. Like his hair is like amazing. I was so happy with all the hair I got at Hair Fair from him. I like them on the pictures of Genesis head but like making a shape for it I have never succeeded and I've always given up <laughs> like luckily that rare selfie phone that they had in one of their gotchas it works with the little Luca head for the most part so like I'm chill with having that rare <laughs> this is the pleased expression I don't think I like this. It makes my lips look like extremely long. I don't like this one. <laughs> then there's Runaway. That looks snarky and sassy. This is kind of snarky. I like this. <laughs> the next one is somber. Very 
very sad. Next one is spicy. Spicy is very flirty. I think with this one she licks her lips. The lip the lick lip is in this. I think so. Yes it is, I was right. Yeah, this is like super flirty. <laughs> and then there's whimsy. It kind of reminds me of like a deer in the headlights a little bit. Like a satisfied, aloof deer in the headlights. That's just completely random. And there are sirens in the background. Jeez. Sorry, guys. But yeah, I like a combination of the irked, the natural, and the idle. I like how it goes. And I like there. there's a separate tab now for the expressions. And I like that you can save your favorites to a favorite section that you can go to. Find all the things that you normally like to use for photos and whatnot. And they're all right there. And then you un click it and then you get your full list but you can notice your favorites are tend to a slightly different color I yeah this new HUD I love new HUD I am happy with the new HUD and I like it I really like the redesign and then there's the vocal which I haven't even tested out because I didn't have it done in world voice at all today the eyelids I figured out that inactive would be what on the old head would be neutral and normally I had neutral so I just always leave my eyes inactive for like most photos I do suspicious because I like narrow kind of angry looking eyes for things but like because relaxed it's just they open a little too big to me or at least they used to I prefer an active so mm -hmm. And then there's eyes and mouth, but I'm not using Luluka eyes. I'm using my system eyes still. Personalized, I never use. And then there's the settings. I don't know. I know I did the interjections of the animations. I did a backup. I don't know what miscellaneous is. And I'm clicking it for the first time. Huh? Miscellaneous one point on. This button will be used in the future for items that may fall under the category of head expansion or an occasional gift. We named it miscellaneous as it will just be random items with no definite timeline. When the button is not in use for a particular item, it will send this note card. Feel free to click on occasion but if we do send items through it, we'll send notices in our in-world group. Good to know. Hey guys, I learned something you guys did too. This latest button, we might get random stuff every here and there from Luluka, which I'm totally down for. But yeah, I like, I like like now there's room with the slots and everything. Like my screen's kind of squished right now, so I could have the chat in there. But like everything like fits perfectly. Tint layers even looks better to me. Like I, I just like it. It's more crisp and it's more like finished and final. I like it. I like it a lot. If I don't cam all over the place, apparently. Um. I think that's all I'm gonna do. I think this is as well as I can decorate this space. There might be a little, there might be a few odds and ends like kind of add it as an afterthought. So thanks guys for hanging out with me. I think I'm gonna go try to edit that horrible deco crate video now 
if I don't end up re-recording it. And then this will be the blog post picture for it and the um, title screen for it, which I think would look really nice. If this is the title screen, I should kind of do it more like this. So there's an open space right here that I can like throw the text on. So that action might end up being a shot. That will be deleted and that wooden prim will be deleted. Delete it. So yeah, that's all I have for now. Thank you guys for hanging out. Have a great night. Bye.